Hi everyone, I'm Brandon Allinger here at Prop Store, and I want to tell you about a really exciting lot coming up in our Entertainment Memorabilia Live auction. This is an original X-Wing fighter model miniature from The Empire Strikes Back. This is a genuine model built and filmed at Industrial Light and Magic in San Rafael for the second film in the original Star Wars trilogy, uh, The Empire Strikes Back. So this model was actually put together from an off-the-shelf model kit, and they did a fair bit of that at ILM just in the interest of saving time and money. You can see when you look at it, the thing that gives it away immediately as being a studio model in my mind is just the paintwork. Uh, it's just phenomenal paintwork on this and that's one thing that ILM was known for is the weathered finish that they brought to all the models that appeared in the Star Wars films uh, really keeping in, in line with the aesthetic that George Lucas brought on to say it's very much a used universe it's not your traditional view of sci-fi where things are highly polished these are working machines that have broken down over the years and been repaired and suffered damage and battles and things like that so I just love the paintwork that's been applied on the fuselage and the wings here uh, some of the, the scorching that's been airbrushed on and the different areas that have been uh, masked off and peeled back to look like they're they're worn through this particular model originated from the collection of special effects supervisor Brian Johnson. Brian Johnson actually won an Academy Award for his work on Empire, and this model was given to him at the end of his time on the film. What I find fascinating about this model is that the little R2-D2 figure, which has been plugged in the back of the ship here, has been set up to face the back rather than the front. For whatever reason, whoever was assembling this model on the day decided that uh, R2 was looking at what was behind him. Maybe he's being chased. So included with the model is a letter of authenticity from jo Brian Johnson. You can see uh, this is signed by Brian and it's dated July 22nd, 2005. The letter talks about the shot that the X-Wing was used in and that is the shot where the Rebels are leaving Hoth and they have several X-Wing fighters that go out to escort the large Rebel transport. So this is an original storyboard here used in the production of the film. This storyboard is from Brian's collection as well. Uh, and it's shot VH-15. And Brian has signed this storyboard and noted that this X-Wing uh, was one of the ships photographed by Ken Ralston during post-production at Industrial Light and Magic. We invite you to please take a closer look at this lot and many others that we have in our upcoming entertainment memorabilia live auction at propstore.com slash live auction.